it's not my first time doing that. I replaced Alan uh, coming in cabaret many years ago. And um, I, I mean, in, in something like this, it's great. There's, there's a certain writing on the wall that you get to take advantage of. I mean, I am indebted to the architecture of the production that, that Neil created along with Michael Mayer. Um, there's certainly room with this character to make it your own. He you know, has this unbelievable career behind him, you know, between Dexter and Six Feet Under, and 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 even though he replaced, kind of reinventing as the MC and, and being in Chicago, and and so he's bringing all of this stuff with his rock star moves and 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 voice, and sticking it all together in this way that is that is con gorgeous and oh, and 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 knocks you back in your seat and it's a little overpowering and it's just beautiful. He also has this real kind of middle European kind of dark thing about him. He's the nicest guy in the world but he's very private so I think he's going to be bringing this kind of darker, he's going to be Hedvig with secrets. You know other Hedvigs everything's right on the sleeve and I think this one is going to have some stuff that she doesn't tell people ever. Every time a Hedwig comes in, my character gets more layered, like more uh, more fleshed out, m deeper. Like So, I mean, I guess if we had a million uh, Hedwigs, I'd be like, I would just turn into Yitzhak. I would just be a man. That's it. I would just get the change, and I'd just change my name to Yitzhak, and I'd just be Yitzhak forever. <laughs> I love this piece. I always have. I loved it when it was downtown. I love the movie. I love this production. And, um, you know, I'm honored to count myself among the actors lucky enough to breathe life into this character.